What's up guys? Today I have a projector that I got from Wish. And it's a mini projector. We are going to unbox it. A little disclaimer though, we already uh unboxed it though because I wanted to test it a couple weeks ago when I got it, so um I know I haven't done a video in a while, so that's the box and stuff. It's just a box. Yeah. Um Josh. You wanna, can you see the whole thing? Not the whole thing. So, um, those are some of the things. Like it's, it projects up to 60 inches. Um, convented imports uh, supports AV, which I don't know why you'd use that, but I have. I'm only using AV for my speaker setup. Um. If Um, and stuff, yeah, and stuff, so, um, we got right here, it says super bright LED, uh, te technological 20,000 hours of battery life, and it supports USB and SD with HDMI, and this says perfect for DVD pictures and more. I've actually been using this for the 360. It is an LED LCD image system. You want to look at that. So, once we get into the box, yeah, I'm getting into it. Okay, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, so when you open the box, you're greeted with this foam thing I guess is if that's what you want to call it it wasn't taped or anything when I got it so take off this sheathy thing in the bobber okay so when I got this I'm not I'm legit like not kidding so it came with the remote and it came with a thumbstick too I wasn't like I think it was one of the free gifts that they said they would send with that so that's in the bag you have your AV to headphone or whatever you want to call that in this bag with the power. And last but not least, you have the projector. That box is just an empty phone box. So, right away, we have the projector. It's warm because I just unplugged it. So, it has, a, it has all these buttons just in case you're too lazy to use the remote. <laughs> but so it has a lens cover and it's manual um it's manual adjust up to 60 inches so right away we take off that lens cover mine's dirty um your lens and everything that's all clean set the projector over there um and then you have your instructions so I think it's all in Japanese um Japanese Japanese that's okay so that size Japanese for any of you Japanese viewers I guess and that's the American for the normal viewers <laughs> um Okay, so we don't need those. You just plug it in and watch your TV or whatever you're going to do. So, we're going to unbox the uh, remote. It's just a weird recycled thing bag. Um, so, you have your remote. It doesn't come with batteries. We had to put them in it. Um, and your thumbstick. It's from SanDisk. Um, yeah. So, you have those. It's really weird, too. It doesn't even... It's weird. Okay. Getting to the point. So, we're not getting to the projector yet. Cause we already took that out, obviously. So, it didn't get raveled up or anything when it came. It was just, like, folded up like that power cord was 
There are choices for Australian, American, and European. Sorry for all you Japanese users. I don't know what you guys use over there, but yeah. So you have your AV, your blue, white, and red. Um, you have those uh, female connectors to the male, um, the male headphone jack, I guess, the adapter. So what we are going to do, I guess, is we're going to show you guys how it works. Now, my room is pretty messy, so this will be fun, but... Condition. Okay, there's power, got our projector. Um, okay. My cameraman just wanted to uh, do that real quick. So, our projector, zoom in, zoom in a little bit. Okay, so you have your projector. Plug it in now. It's on the side right there. That's power. It does have a USB port, so we're gonna stick the thumb drive in there. Rest in peace, headphone users, for what I'm gonna show you the test on. Oh, and it's on for some weird goddamn reason. Okay. Um. We turn the light off, Josh. Yep. Oh, yep. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see it. Can you hand me the uh yeah. here, hand it to me. So um that's the smallest we can no, is it? Yeah, that's the smallest we can project it. Um, in my room right now. It's about a 35 inch. The biggest we can project it. You'll see it get better quality in a second. Okay. Um, so. Sorry if you guys can't see, but it turns out to be like a 70 inch. I know it said 60, but it's lying. So. Yeah. Rest in peace, headphone users, because... For this, what we're gonna do is loud. Okay, so we got our AV cable thingy to our male headphone jack. Plug that into right there. Or at least that's for what we're doing, because we're plugging it in as speakers on the other side. It's just a, uh, another one of those, but a little bit different. Sorry if you guys couldn't see that. So we do that, and you see it hanging out. So we'll take our speaker cable. Um, is that our speaker cable? Yeah, okay. So you're gonna take your speaker cable and you're gonna plug it into the white and red there. That's what we're doing for this, otherwise you'd be using just the normal, hold on a second, sorry if you guys can't see, but be just the normal, uh, just the normal AV cords right there. See, red, white, and yellow. So I guess we'll plug red, white, and yellow in because those are the ones plugged in to the speaker. So plug those in right there. Plug white in right there. Plug red in right there. Okay, there's the projector, lens cap, all that good sizzle. Okay, so remote, projector. Go like that. Press input. You're greeted with the inputs on the screen. Focus, focus, focus. 
Okay, you're greeted with the inputs on the screen. And we're going down to USB. So, once you go to USB, this remote small, you are greeted with that screen. Now, I have an LED light on, so it's pretty bright, obviously. Um, go over to music. Yeah, let's put on See You Again, I guess. Um, okay. It projects it pretty well. It's been a long day without you, my friend. That's, that's the quality of the projector. That's the, this is the quality of my speakers. We've come a long way from where okay. we began. No more of that. Okay, so we're going to switch it to HDMI. Um, give me a second to plug that in. Now we're just going to be using a simple 360 hooked up to HDMI. Because I'm cheap and I use 360 still. Yeah. Um, power her on. She's going on over there. By the way, um, let me know how you like the paint job. I'm going to set, set my Xbox up. Okay, turn that back up. I don't know how good you guys can see that, but... Yeah, so it shows stuff moving pretty good, I shall say. And what you guys are seeing on the screen is actually a hell of a lot better than it is on the uh, projector there. So, yeah, that's the unboxing portion. I'm going to turn this off. I'm going to give you some shots of my Xbox. So I just used some simple masking tape. I don't know where my thing is to show you guys my masking tape. I think it's in here. Might be. No. My drawer's a mess, sorry. Um Okay. Get the computer speakers out of the way. Or just like that. So we have the Apple logo. All that. Gotta clean all that up, but it looks good on this side. The other side is just nice and plain and good, yeah. So, um, so that's that. Signature painting. Okay, stop. Stop, kid. Okay, um, so. That's going to conclude it for our videos, guys. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.